In this video, we'll review how to create and manage questions. First, click on Questions in the left navigation bar to open the question bank. You'll see three or four tabs containing questions. First, you have your Organization Content tab, which shows any questions created by you and others in the organization. Next is the My Content tab, which only shows questions created by you. Then we have the Codapad Examples tab, which has ready-to-use questions created by Codapad. And finally, if you have any questions you've created but not yet set to active, you will also see a Drafts tab. There are two ways to create a question. First, you could browse the example questions and click on Edit a Copy to customize one. Or, if you'd prefer to create a question from scratch, click on the blue Create Question button. This will open the question wizard. First, select whether you're creating a question to be used during live interviews, for take-home assignments, or for both. If you wish to include test cases, select only take-home. You can then choose to add a starter drawing for either. Give your interview question a name and select the environment that you want it to be in. It will be pre-filled with your default language, but you can delete that to choose another. Select the difficulty. Then, if you've chosen a take-home, specify the time limit. Next, add a description that is visible internally if you want. And finally, decide whether to allow colleagues to view and edit your question. Moving on to the next step, adding code elements. Here, you must include candidate instructions, and the rest is optional. If you have multiple steps, you can add several different instructions to show as you progress through the interview. Just click on Add Follow-on Instructions to add steps. Then add any useful notes or an interview guide and the solution. This will be visible only to the interviewer. You can then upload a custom database and custom files if necessary. The next step is the starter code. You can see the code editor pane along with the instructions you just added, just as a candidate would see it. You also have access to ChatGPT in the AI Assist tab if you want to do any searches to speed up the question creation. Once you're done, go ahead and click Save. This will automatically save your question as a draft. You can choose to promote it to an active question immediately or leave it in the Drafts tab if it's not quite ready or you wish to have a colleague look over it first. Once the question has been promoted to active, you can use it immediately to create a live pad or take home. You can also find it later in the My Content tab in the question bank. There, you can preview or create a pad. Or if you wish to edit, copy or delete, hover over the three dots. And that's how to create and edit questions.